Hi, my name is Steve Dawes and I'm the Services Director from Servium. I'm pleased to be here today to continue our series of On the Sofa. Today we're going to be talking about the HP EliteBook range. I'm joined by Danny Williams. Hi Danny, how are you doing? Hey Steve, thank you very much for having me. Could you just explain what your role is within HP? Yeah, sure. So I'm the HP Commercial Premium Business Manager for UK and Ireland and I just uh, give training sessions to uh, everyone who has these products and on their, in their catalogue. So you're there to support sort of premium resellers such as ourselves around the Leapbook range? Correct, yep. Giving additional training, um, an overview of the, of the range and also loan devices okay. potentially. Okay, that's good. So you've kindly loaned me one of these for the, for the last month. I must say that um, I've been using this on my travels. It's a great device, I must admit. Perfect. Um, you know, I'm mightily impressed and everyone knows I love my tech. This really does uh, does impress me. So, Good. what is it you think about the the Elite Book range that makes it stand out from the competition? Well, with, with my role in particular, really passionate about it, and I love the actual uh, devices that I'm, I've got to play with. Mm. So, I get a lot of feedback saying about the design mm. feature. Yeah, so, again, yeah. you can actually yeah. tell by um, just looking at you know yeah. the whole the new emblem on the side, the actual. Um, sheer it just feels robust it feels nice yeah, it does, obviously yeah. we've got a little magnetic strip as well on the top for the pen yeah, yeah. available as well and it just uh, it seems super lightweight so the design feature a lot of people comment on um the security offering as well it's immense the security stack which i'll touch on shortly mm. but and also the collaboration keys so again when you're doing skype for business mm -hmm. You've got a lot of the keys on here so again if it's ringing all these highlight and all these light up so you can actually see what's going on okay. when you're immersed in the content so it's got different modes as well that that, um, that I've found of, uh, of sort of uh, a benefit. So obviously you've got the, the normal uh, uh, laptop mode. So do you want to explain a little bit about the sort of different modes that you can use this device in? Yes, of course. So with this one, so again, you've got traditional uh, laptop mode, like you said, this is a convertible design. Mm. So again, you've got this kind of mode, you've got the uh, wolf racing conferencing mode as well. Yeah. So again, if you're Skyping, um, sorry, for audio yeah. kind of thing, you've got that. You've got the tent mode. So when you're presenting, so we can go on the table like that. Yeah, yeah. So again, we both can see what's going on. Or you've got the actual, you've got the stand mode. All right, yeah. So it's like a media mode, is it? Correct, yeah. yeah. So when you're in the hotel room uh, or at home, watch, you can watch a film. And then you've also got the traditional tablet mode. Tablet mode, yeah, yeah. And again, with the, with the portability and how lightweight it is, mm. this feels so easy. Mm, mm. I must admit, it's very light, it's very versatile. You know, the, the design is, is, is sort of superb. Obviously, it's using the new Intel architecture, so what does that sort of give uh, to the features of this device? It gives it a whole new um, realm of uh, security offering. So being with the Elite Books, all of these guys from the 800 series and above have the Intel um, inside it. Mm -hmm. So with that, again, the Windows Hello, which you use for the facial recognition yeah. to log yeah. on, that's based on Intel as all well. It, yeah. Uh, so with their security offering as well, and BIOS working in partnership with Intel and the Elite Books, it just works so well together. So you talk about security features. I know what I think one of the main ones I've, I've used. And there's probably a lot of things under the bonnet that I'm not aware of. But okay. when I'm travelling and I'm trying to do conventional work, say on on a train or in a hotel, the sure view mm -hmm. um, is a great way of sort of limiting the uh, the viewing angle of the uh, of the device. So. Talk, talk me through a little bit about that and, and some of the other security features. I'm glad you've been finding your view very helpful. Mm, it's good. Especially on the train environment, because mm. you, sat, you sat very close to someone. And also at this kind of angle, it's yeah, kind of 35 yeah. degrees yeah. kind of thing. So when you press F2, so we try to make it as easy as possible. So by pressing F2, it puts on an integrated privacy filter, which means anyone from 35 degrees of the screen can't see what you're, what you're working on. I must admit that, 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 you know, that's a great sort of, sort of feature of, uh, of the device, but Again, integration windows, hello, and so on and so forth. Mm -hmm. You mentioned uh, to me when we talked before about some of the sort of recovery features as well. So mm -hmm. explain a little bit about that as part of the, uh, the sort of security stack. Yeah, sure. So we've got HP Show Recover, which means again, um, so you can recover your system image anywhere, anytime. So what I'm getting at is it basically, so that's thanks to the firmware uh, embedded mm. um, self-healing system right. image. So with that it just means there's no need for an IT department but like, there's no downtime if you if you uh, come into trouble then basically you can do it all yourself just with a wired and ethernet cable right okay so so that's good from a sort of a user experience point of view mm -hmm. um also from a fleet point of view as well yeah, i mean yeah. it could be sent to the menu so again if you needed a new system image sending across the fleet so if you've got employees mm. 50 plus mm. you could send all that information to all of them at once mm. so my understanding security is built up from the 
from the BIOS upwards. So right. explain a little bit about, about that, could you? Yeah, so that's called Shear Start. So whether it's idle mode, so you, you just close yeah. the screen now, but your start is still working in the background, mm. right? So when you power it on, BIOS is very important. So again, the BIOS is the first million lines of uh, the firmware code. Mm. Um, and again, it's responsible for making sure that the OS uh, starts up securely. Uh, if the BIOS is affected or corrupted, then that, you know, that's a well, that's, you fall into a lot of trouble. Mm. You know, mm. data, bre data breaches, mm. uh, ransomware. Mm. And again, that is, so again, by having a um, strong core, yeah. Thanks to Intel and also HP, that means we've got the foundations right. Uh, on top of this sure, sure start, we've got Sure Run, which makes sure that all the applications are still running, uh, right. running properly. Um, with Sure Run in particular, it um, alerts, detects any changes to the BIOS um, code in the operating system, and then it restores it back. Uh, it, it turns it back. It automatically turns it back on if it's been turned off. Um, just also touching back on the security stack. Yeah. Um, yeah. When you're browsing on the internet, yeah, you're secure. You're secure as well okay. because we've got a feature in there called HP SureClick, which is a virtualization-based security. And then from that, what happens is every time you go into a tab, so whether that's Chrome, um, we partnered up with Bromium for this. So whether it's Chrome or Microsoft Edge, Edge. what happens is when you open up the individual tabs, what happens is it isolates um, the malware in its own micro virtual machine. Right, okay. Which means if there's any malware attached to that P PDF or your uh, Microsoft Word or Publisher or Excel, it isolates it into that Microsoft machine. And then once you click on the um, X symbol, it gets rid of it. Wow, okay. So, so that, yeah, that's that's a great sort of hidden a hidden feature. And a lot of these are, they're mm. very subtle, you mm. know, from the start, show start, to the show run, yeah, to the yeah. show click, to the show view. They're all very seamless. You know, it's a one touch button to get the show view and how easy that is to get on. That's mm. how everything else is working in the background. I must admit, you know, I've been using this device for, for a month and I'm not even aware of a lot of these security features. They're just been going on in the background, which is, <laughs> which, you know, which is great. Perfect. So again, I think security being the, you know, the, the sort of main standout features to, uh, to me. Um, I think the other thing I found as well when I've been using this in sort of daily business life is the battery life. Mm -hmm. So what is making this such a small, elegant device, how come the battery life is, you know, is, is so long? Well, we've got these, these elite books, we've got, um, it's, it's just a, because it's, we, we're in the elite range, range now kind of thing, you're getting 16 hours plus battery. Mm. Uh, again, that's just a, a byproduct of just how premium it is. Right, okay. So you're just getting a, a super long battery. We've also got the fast charge feature. Right, okay. Which means yeah. if it's got less than, um, with, it, with 30 minutes charge from a zero battery, you get 50% 50 50 wow, battery. Okay. So that's good, for, from, again, from a mobility, portability point of view. Yes. Also, just, just touching on that, in mm. terms of um, portability, you know, we always, because it's really nice and elegant, like you mm. said, you know, you might be worried about dropping it, for yeah. example. Okay. So all these guys in the elite range, they have the military um, standard 810G um, rating. Right, okay. Which means it needs to pass 12 tests in order to wow. be sold. Okay. So, so th a few of them tests involve the explosives, uh, temperature. Mm -hmm. So in that scenario, you could put this in your luggage when you're traveling. On a plane, yeah, yeah. And then it can make sure that it, you know the low temperatures it will still be okay to so, uh, okay. work functional. Yeah. And also, um, so the temperature, uh, explosives, and also dust, which is important, you mm. know, because you never mm. know where it's going to be mm. where it's going to be kept. Mm. So that's that's the device I've been using the, the sort of the G2. You've got some more devices here. Do you want to really just sort of give us a quick run through on a couple of the devices you brought with you today? Of course, yeah. So I've got the. <coughs> The 1040 mm -hmm. uh, G4, so this one is the Elite Book range as well, this uh, 1000 series. Um, with this one in particular, so again, it's very similar in terms yeah, of yeah. design. Yeah, very that similar, one. Yeah. You know, you've got the okay, collaboration. premium fini uh, very, finish and so on. Yep, the aluminium um, chassis. You've got the, again, the glossy screen. On this one, you've got the collaboration keys. Um, this one's a little bit bigger, so this mm. is the 1040, so 14-inch 14 14 screen. 14-inch, yeah. Versus that 1020, which is a 12-inch screen. Uh, again, you've got all the normal, uh, you've got the IR sensors, you've got multi-factor authentication on this one, so whether that's a PIN or a password or your fingerprint mm. or your face. So four ways of log logging in to your notebook is a lot better than one kind of mm. thing. So it's like mm. the whole stack, even to get into the device, is is impressive. Mm. So this one is um, one of the one of the top range as well, one of the top sellers. Okay, yeah. We've got a Z book. Okay. This is the fifteen point six. This is more of a workstation, to be okay. honest. A little bit, little bit, um, really powerful. Yeah, I can say it's a more powerful device, isn't it? You're looking at sixteen uh, gig gigabytes of RAM on this one in two like two sixteen gigs of RAM. So again, it's, in terms of performance, this one's huge. Six cell battery. 
again, everything what you saw on the previous ones, we, we always um, extend the security stack onto the other range as okay. well and the elite range. Okay. So again, this has got the fingerprint, the windows hello. This one's got a window shutter on there as well. Uh, for the webcam again yeah. privacy filter uh, that's a that's another option as well this one's a bit of a different screen yeah. versus the uhd uh, ultra definition 4k screen on what you what you've got there yeah. this one's a matte screen uh, and we've actually got an award winner with okay this today, right which is the 840 so what's this one uh, an award for then uh so this is the business laptop of the year 2019 right, wow. uh so this is the 840 um g5 this one in particular is a, this, this seems to be like the go-to uh, mm. notebook again for many reasons. Price point that's really good. Security stack mm. that's exactly the same mm. as the other ones you've seen. Um, and in, in terms of the branding, you can see it, st it still stays keeps the same suit as the other yeah. one. Yeah. Um, this one again, the reason why it won the award is because of three things really. So the privacy screen. Yeah. You've got the security stack offering, and also the collaboration. Yeah. Such as like the uh, third microphone. On here for the Skype uh, conference, mm. it just it enhances the experience a lot more. So that's the award winner, which again I'm pressed for the entire range, but um, I think you've pierced the resistance that you brought along today. I think we'd all like to see that. Um, okay. Explain about your backpack. <laughs> yeah, let's go. All right, so we've got uh, so this is the HP branded backpack. So this is the power up backpack again, yeah. as you can see, looks awesome. Yeah, it's good. Yeah. yeah. So this one, what's special about this? So this has got a 2,300 milliamp battery inside it, which means as I'm walking uh, out and about doing my demonstrations, uh, it charges all my devices okay. inside the bag. So you've got the you've got the charger, so the big battery, battery, yeah. battery in there. Yeah. And then from there, what happens is it, it loops it all the way through. So it's all you nice bank. and neat and yeah. Okay, so you've got multiple devices there. So you've got yeah. micro USB, micro USB, iPhone, USB-C, wow. Yeah. And then again, that keeps it all in one place. Yeah. Nice and secure. Yeah. And uh, yeah, it's a part of the whole ecosystem. Yeah, yeah, okay, no, that's brilliant. Well, look, Danny, I really want to thank you today for uh, taking the time out to, uh, to sit with me on the sofa and go through the, go through the range. Um, so thank you very much. I want to thank you as well. Thank you very much for having me today. It's been awesome. Thank You're you for your time. So for everyone watching, thank you very much for taking the time out to, uh, to view our video. And I think for next steps, if anyone's interested, um, we are working with HP in providing some short-term loans. So if you would like to look at one of these devices in more detail, please contact your account manager or go to our website, serving.com, and uh, we can talk to you about a, a, a loan of uh, one of the Leapbook range. So thank you and goodbye.